Somebody call a doctor because bad medicine is back. That's the answer. This is the Appleton Oak. I'm Mason Quinn. Guys, everybody on YouTube wanted us to check out this movie. So thanks to Broad Strokes, we are going to be taking a look at Severus Snape and the Marauders, the Harry Potter prequel. And I am really excited to see what this fan-made movie uh, is all about. It just it speaks to how passionate the Potterverse is when fans are making like this is uh, I think it's almost a half hour long. Yeah. It's upwards of like 12 million views. <laughs> yeah, broad strokes and, crushed uh, it. And and what other franchise? I mean, would people put in the kind of work where you have that? quality of a product and so i already know i'm at the point now where if it's anything potter i'm not going to be like oh we'll wait and see i know i'm excited i think it's going to be awesome so yeah i mean just from looking through the quick like uh thumbnails and everything it looks like they did a really good job and really put a lot of time and effort into it so that's where i can't wait to see just how great of a job they did uh, i came out 2016 so they're not going to be limited too much by technology so that's why i I really can't wait for it, so I'm ready, willing, and able to watch <laughs> this fan-made film. Yeah. yeah, so again, guys, big thanks to Broad Strokes. We got all their info in the description box. You can check them out. So without further ado, let's go! Right off the bat, initial comment. Huge quality. Quality is awesome. Oh, have I seen your ID? Boy, have I seen your ID? Oh, he's making him forget. Okay. Let me get you another one. Yeah. What do you care? I enjoy a good story. Trust me, it's nothing special. Try and... Wow, nice. just, just with that intro, I'm already hooked. That was really good. I really like how they're, how they're doing this so far. What? This is awesome. <laughs> wow. Are you going to the party tonight then, Remus? I think so. Well, oh, you should I, be with The answer is yes. But with Mary, right? How'd you find out? How do I find out? Oh, Remus. We've all seen the letters. We've all seen the letters. We assumed you did. They're oh, not letters. Yeah, they keep sliding under our door. No, they're love letters. They're love letters. Yeah. They're not... <laughs> hey. so you'll take Mary. Yeah, you're going to take Regulus. No, Regulus has another date with Slughorn, I'm sure. <laughs> and Peter, who are you taking? Uh, I think I'm the one to go to Stag for once. Oh, wow. <laughs> you're going to take your shirt? Yeah, is yeah. If you change your shirt... I like it. I'm trying to be honest. Change your shirt. <laughs> <laughs> it's just, it's the best over it. Best are in. I hear girls are warm, too, just so you know. Yeah, like warmer than vests, almost. Oh, you're right, mate. Yeah, you don't look so good. Favorite time of the month's coming up. Oh, come on, it's not for what, three more days? Oh, yeah. Oh, you guys don't know. They haven't watched the books. Read the books. I know. Hogwarts no more. I was looking for a clue when they said that. This feels like the world's end a little bit. <laughs> so these three guys know that he turns into a werewolf every month. So that's in the books and not the movies. Okay. That they know about his thing. That and they would explain that. Yep. Oh, she'll be around. It's her favorite pub. I've read the book. Well, audio book. <laughs> no, not likely. But she, um... I don't know. She made me see things different. Like, maybe there's more to life than... Quidditch in map building, I suppose. Is not. <laughs> Come on. Not. Like it'll make us legends. And that map wouldn't be anything without me. <laughs> yeah, so you won't stop saying. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. The, the map the that you got to the see. The map where you can sure. see everything. It's kind of fun. Yep. This is really fun so far. Jobs, but we'll stay together. I don't mean it like that. I mean with what's coming. Some might fight with us. Some might get killed. Some might fight against us. People we went to school with facing us on some battlefield. All I know is, we're not going anywhere. And not one Death Eater's gonna have a row at us, so long as we're together. Yeah, 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 yeah. What if it's a friend facing us? Someone under the Imperious Curse? Or worse, someone who wants to be there? Someone like... Snake. Exactly. No, I mean, 
He's right there. <laughs> oh, whoops. Oh. Foot in mouth. Classic. I, I. What do you think he's doing here? I reckon I know. Ah, uh, yeah. You want to have a go at him? What? No? Are you no. serious? No, you're serious. Come on, we're not going to see him again, anyways. Are you mad? Right here in the pub. No, <laughs> we'll take him elsewhere. Come on, James. Yeah, I'm not a family rat while we're at school, but I don't think they've got shared cells in Azkaban. Look, you said it yourself. <laughs> we're going our own way. Which way do you think he's going to go? Slamming so you guys know it's, it's Potter, yeah, Sirius so Black, Pettigrew, and Remus. We're not going to kill him. And beating him up is only going to piss him off worse. Look after what you did. Oh, what I did? Oh, when I saved him from you after he went sneaking about. Can't we just enjoy our drinks? This isn't about Snape and Lily, is it? No. Of course oh, it is. That's why you want to start trouble. Come Look, on. we need to make sure he fears us when the time comes. Oh. I'm going to do it. Do you understand? What about the rest of you? You know I've got your back, mate. Peter? There's no more curses in this first year than any of us do We'll now. be fine as long as we're together. Yeah, but you're gonna turn your back anyways, yeah. dick. As long as we're all together. Oh, and he's like, as long as we're doing all... God, you can <laughs> see, like... He's making sure he's following along. The, it's a real risk, James. The, 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 yeah. They got everybody who looks like the characters, mm -hmm. too. Yeah, this wow. is wild. Yeah, the casting is excellent. We're not going to hurt him. We're just going to scare him. Of course we are. <laughs> come on, come on. <laughs> Snivellus, what you doing here? Nothing. Don't look like nothing. Are you trying to get a drink? Oi, have you seen his ID? What do you want? You're not welcome here. I'm minding my own business. It's a shame that I mind it too. Leave me alone. Come on, Snake, oh. give me an excuse. Come on! Do you see this bloke? He's a Slytherin recently graduated. Stay on your guard around him. You won't take it outside of the lot of your spinched. Four against one. Very brave. <laughs> spectating. She'll never forgive you, you know that? I reckon that's why you're here. Try and mend things after what you called her. A mudblood. Oh. Or someone else a werewolf. Or perhaps the minister would like to know. James. Going too far. How to hear the lot of you now? She's threatening to bust out Remus as being a werewolf. Yeah. Fine. I'll give you what you want. But not here. You're not a perfect place. Gentlemen. That is. Come on, man. You're gonna set up for like a magic duel or what? James. Must be. I thought he was gonna alligator arm him. <laughs> do the I'll see you later. I'm gonna hang out with her. <laughs> do the old whoopsie do. <laughs> oh, nice. Still not what I used for. <laughs> Quite fun to this spot. Lily loves to snog here. Oh, it's boy. Like oh, wow. If you beat me, I'll stay away from Lily. But if I beat you, you stay away from Lily for the rest of your life. It's not some prize to be won. Then you forfeit. It's fine by me. Come on, Snivy. Give me a good one. Right to the jaw. Boy, Potter's a real jerk. Come on. No. Oh, 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 oh,
ready for what Snape was bringing, is he? Oh. This is awesome. <laughs> the effects here. Oh, the old backhand. Sneaky. Oh, we got, Jeez, we whoa, got rapid whoa, fire hey, darts. Hey, hey. Oh, I pulled some Neo stuff there. Spaliamus! Oh! Uh oh. Now what? It's, now it's gonna get actually physical. <laughs> now it's not a wizard fight, now it's just a real fight. He's trying to get his one. Oh. Whoa! <laughs> oh! That's a big fall. He said he's, he could handle it. He's already lost the match. Let's say he's got to know Snape's got to beat. Taking on two versus one. Hang it in there. There is stone. Bloody hell. Three on one. one. Snape's still holding his own. Yeah. I'd say holding his own pretty well. Kind of makes you not like James Potter too much, well, doesn't it? Not much at Killing all. It. Having fun yet? It's a bit tougher than we expected, I'll give him that. Yeah, right on this right half like on the front. Oh, oh look at that. Yeah. One, two, three. Oh, got him good. I 
mean, again, fan made. Yeah. Incredible. Yeah, this is. These guys are fans, but clearly their their skill set goes <laughs> way beyond just being fans. He knows that Snape hasn't even scratched the surface of what he can do yet. Flashback put him over. Yep. You know, watching this and then thinking back to how Snape was towards Harry, it just like ties yeah. it together yeah. so much. Totally makes sense. The only reason he w he was anything remotely of nice towards him was because of um, Lily. Yeah. yeah. It's just please, Severus, please, Severus, please, please, what? Please, what? Please spare you. Is that what you want, Potter? You think that you can hex and curse me all these years, take away the one person that I ever cared about, and then you think that you can just brush me off? No idea what it is like to be me. You have no idea what it is like to lose something. You're right. All right. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. He can't do it. You're sorry. Now that I've bloodied you up, now that you fear me. Well, don't worry, Potter. You won't last much longer. No, Severus, don't. Goodbye, Potter. Severus, please! Oh, he was gonna hit him with it, too. Oh. He was gonna do it. Have you gone mad? What are you all doing? Lily. You think that one last row would solve everything? And what were you... What have you done? What have you 
you done? What has he done? Oh, they, I he, will never forgive you for this. What about when it was four on one? The dude you started it. Done. You tell me right now. We started it. Oh, oh well, at, least, at least he owns up to it. Yeah. Came to the bar to see you, and we tried to scare him off. You. All of you. What were you doing there? I, I just came to try to say. To say what? To say that I'm sorry. I don't deserve to have you as a friend of the like hold you. I know that. I've lived with it these past few years. You were my best friend and I ruined it. I ruined it after calling you that terrible name that I don't deserve to call anyone. I just came to try to tell you how horrible I was and how grateful I am that you were there for me when no one else was. Oh. I'll never bother you again, Lily. I hope that you can just... Well, there's a little bit of redemption for him. There we go. And you still console people like Bellatrix. Ooh. Show me, Severus. Show me, and I might forgive you. Actions speak louder than words, my friends. Yes, they do. Much, much louder. <laughs> Wasn't there a it's in what we do and not what we say quote in there somewhere from Dumbledore? Oh, he so messed gotta... Black up good. And Remus. I hope to see you again. think that is. I know what it feels like to be subjugated. Well, I, th I think we know who that is. <laughs> do you? I do. In fact, I think you have exactly what I'm looking for, Severus. What do you mean? For our ranks. What, what ranks? Who are you? see an ad for another I, sequel up there? I, I thought we guys saw did? that up in the corner. Said Wizarding War. Alright, wow. Justin Zagri. Huge shout out to Broad Strokes. You guys are incredible. Uh, yeah, just by seeing, just by skipping through the the things. Uh, was there? Oops. <laughs> Whatever. But yeah. Just by looking through that, it looked like they had a bunch of people help out on that. Yeah, a lot so, of credit. So, wow, guys. That was awesome. That was a lot of fun, and huge, huge congratulations to Broad Strokes for pulling that off because you guys did an amazing job. I mean, you know, you never know what you're going to get with fan-made stuff, right? Mm -hmm. I mean, you don't know what the budget's going to be like, what kind of actors you're going to get, casting, whatever, but... 
I mean, the, wow, they were able he's... to have a pub and have it full of people. Yeah. You know, in the in the era and and every in the Potterverse, I should say. Yeah, these guys crushed. It was awesome. Yeah, fantastic job. I loved the bit of backstory, uh, like we were kind of talking about during it. Uh, boy, James Potter, not uh, not the stand up guy we we're <laughs> made to believe, you know. But this was a lot of fun. I'm glad we got to watch it. Thank all of you on YouTube for recommending this to us and. Judging by the little preview that we got, there might be more of this to come. Yeah, this was this was phenomenally done. Um, again, everybody recommended this to us, so we, we you know we had a pretty fair idea that this was going to be a quality production and had high expectations. But it just looks like it could have been a, uh, an outtake from the movie. Yeah, basically, yeah. I mean, these guys did a phenomenal job. The casting was spot on yeah. for everybody. Um, the fact that they, you know. The fact that they just gave us a little bit of backstory on what was a very major, consistent theme throughout all the Potter movies in Snape kind of having it out for Harry. And, and they gave us a little bit of backstory um, when, you know, kind of Harry looked into his memories and saw the yeah. bullying and, and things like that that was done. But this just do dove into that a little bit further. And I like that you know they could have given us a lot of backstory on a lot of different mm -hmm. things and you know now we have these movies out the fantastic beast movies which yeah. is yep. his backstory but this was specifically just on that relationship and the bad blood between snape and uh and harry's dad and i think they just did a phenomenal job the the film quality was great as uh answer had pointed out the 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 sets were phenomenal the the uh the visual effects yeah i mean this was a production you know when people are like oh it's a fan movie it's like these are guys who look it's not it's not warner bros but yeah. these are guys who these are clearly yeah. these are clearly professionals clearly people who have a vast vast film experience you know i in in my line of work we do a lot of video work a lot of video editing and there's some very talented people and it, look it doesn't take you know somebody with a lot of experience to look at this and realize like wow but for somebody who does work with video editing and a lot of things like that you just have a, a bigger appreciation for this so uh i don't know i i know where i know where uh we're used to throwing ratings given everything that went into this the visual yep. effects the casting everything Five. Oh, full five. five. I, gotta, I gotta give these look. This is a fan made movie. <laughs> oh, uh, full five answers. Yep. Hands down. Mason Quinn. I will echo the sediments of the Appleton Oak. Sediments? Eh, you know what I mean. <laughs> and go five out of five answers. <laughs> this was so much fun. Gonna Man. have to make it unanimous. Also yeah. five. This was really well done. Really well written. <laughs> they, it's like everybody they had cast was like perfect for their yeah. roles. The young Snape was. Pr I mean, he did a really good yeah. job. And so it. it God, it makes me want to watch the Harry Potters again. Yeah, because it. I've seen fan-made stuff before, and it's it's good. It explains the story. And like, okay, that was kind of fun. And it's, I've never seen a fan-made film like this ever. I'm and just like, glad nice that, to see the uh, interpretation they had. You know. So so we're going to be doing um, my reviews of the audiobooks. I'm through at this point. I'm through Prisoner of Azkaban and starting on the Goblet of Fire. Um, all three audiobooks, phenomenal. You guys were not kidding, but those, those reviews and comparisons to the movies will be coming. But I was just so happy, and um, I'm going to give a little spoiler to these guys, and I'm guessing most of the people who are watching this um, have read the books, but if not, book spoiler alert in five, four, three, two, one. You guys aren't doing the books anytime soon, are you? I know with their schedules and stuff, I was, you know... I had a little bit more liberty to do that. But so in um, in Prisoner of Azkaban, they talk about how James Potter, how Sirius Black, and how Peter Pettigrew knew that Remus was a werewolf. And they scheduled all sorts of activities oh, okay. around it. And it was a monthly thing. They helped create the Marauder's Map. And it was, um, it was like a big thing that they all knew the entire time that Remus was a werewolf. And, and and spend a, a little bit, and I, I was a lot in the books, but I believe they the Marauders map was to help. Um, they had secret passages that got Remus out into the little house in the Whomping Willow. Um, don't beat me up too bad. It's been like I said, it's been no, it's been a little bit of a break between Azkaban, and I'm like immersed in all things Potter. But so they they explain <laughs> a lot in um, the Prisoner of Azkaban book about what was happening 
here. I was okay. just like, ah, I, was, I, I was in the book. I was in the book. <laughs> so, God, this is, this makes me like, I'm so like happy, huh? full blown like Potterhead now. <laughs> like, yeah, just uh, I'll sit back and, you know, just revel in the fact. But, uh, but yeah, um, I think uh, it goes without saying we're going to double check into whether there is a sequel to this. Um, that's going to be coming if there is. Yeah, and there I is. think that's what it said. Yeah. And again, for those of you watching, um, we're going to sit down with the three of us. I'm going to talk about the the books and the differences between the movies. We're going to have a little bit of a discussion. Look, it's been the uh, the three amigos here for all things Potter, and um, myself going through the audio books. Um, like I said, with the, with the way my work schedule and everything lines up, um, I have a lot of time for that. <laughs> um, so, but we're gonna all have a, a discussion between the three of us. I'll probably shift over to to Quinn's spot yeah. and, and, and take the lead. But those yeah. are coming as well. And continue to drop the comments down below because we're like all in for all things Potter. Mm -hmm. And so, if there's other videos you guys want to see, quizzes, other fan made stuff. Although I'm guessing this is like the cream of the crop. Yeah, I'm, yeah, yeah I'm assuming. But just all things Potter that you guys are interested in, in seeing, we're interested in doing. So let us know in the comments below. Um, really love all the interactions that we've had from day one with all of our Potter stuff, and we really hope to keep that going with you guys. Well, well there you go. So for Appleton Oak, Mason Quinn, I'm, of course, the answer. Good night, pals.